Christmas. We get this fire from the house. Why did it come in here? Shit. Forty, and they're starting fire outside. And my wife told me that look at outside; they got big smoke outside. So I opened the door, and they big fires in the front of the house. He never say hi, and he just he just work. Yes, I met him a couple times. He's kind of a little mean. He doesn't talk too much. He's kind of quiet. And uh, every time I say hi, he ignore me. He looking at me. Stranger look. He's looking at me all the time. Stranger looking. So I never talked to him. I, I, I used to work in electronics, so I was an engineer. Yeah, I got up uh, to go to the, to the bathroom, I opened my uh, curtain, and uh, when I look out the street, I saw some uh, police uh, activity. A uh, couple of police cars, uh, like a, what it seemed like a fire engine, and perhaps a SWAT uh, car. And... Uh, and, and that's it. I uh, observed for a while, and uh, then I uh, went downstairs and did whatever I do, you know, daily. But then I came back like uh, half an hour, maybe an hour later, and they were still there. Uh, but then uh, my wife turned on the TV, and from the media, we learned what had happened. And the connection between uh, what had happened at the, with the site where those people were unfortunately killed and the home site here. Yeah. Of course, yeah, you know, that would scare anybody on any neighborhood uh, because you, I mean, I, like uh, I walk here every, almost every other day around this corner right here. And I mean, who's gonna think of that, uh, even though they're not your next door neighbor, but neighborhood neighbor, uh, that something like this could happen.